Chicago! Getting to this moment was probably like the hardest thing I've ever done. Good morning guys. It's like just after five and I am getting ready to do a workout. I did a workout yesterday at the gym today. I just don't feel like doing it going out right now. So I found a workout on my iPad I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna change my clothes really quickly. <sighs> And hopefully I'm gonna show you guys what I've been eating. And I'm trying to try to make this a quick video and get it up for you guys this week. If it doesn't go up tonight, hopefully it'll go Friday night or Saturday. I don't have internet yet, so I'm using the internet on my phone or my iPad. So yeah, I'm gonna get dressed and We'll talk later when I something. Good morning! Hopefully you guys can see me and hear me okay. I am driving. I'm on the turnpike. Um, my car is packed. Okay. And I'm moving to Chicago! Okay, so it was really last minute and uh, I think I'll be here for like a year and maybe like a year and a half. I have no idea, you guys. So um, I didn't show any of me packing because I was, I literally got home Friday, like evening, packed all Friday night. It's Saturday morning at 10 a.m. right now and we're on the road. So... I don't know where I'm gonna stay yet. Um, we have to go find all that because I start school on Monday. So hopefully by the time you see this, I'm not totally frantic and going crazy. I'm drinking Starbucks because that was what we were by on the way out. You guys know I'm Dunkin' through and through, but this isn't bad. This is a cold brew with toffee nut syrup and oat milk. Fun fact, the new apple crisp syrup has milk in it, which is weird because it's clear, but they're reading the ingredients to me while I was in there because they're awesome. It has milk in it. So, um, yeah, the car is packed. My mom, I did pretty good, you guys. Normally, I like pack the car, pack the other car, and it's like an insane amount of stuff. But I have like kitchen stuff and like blankets and all that jazz. And it's really only in my car. So that's awesome. I'll show you guys like what's going on. Hopefully, by the grace of God, oh, there's a bug in here. Dang, blast it. Um, that I find an apartment today that would just be superb. It's a beautiful day for driving. I've got my jet fuel. And yeah, here we go. <laughs> really I forgot my stand at home too for the car so that's unfortunate but hi it is Tuesday at 6 41 and I just finished my first day in the hospital that's crazy to say I didn't honestly getting to this moment was probably like the hardest thing I've ever done <laughs> uh. So I'm getting Chick-fil-A right now. I just got some new shoes because I was trying to be cute and got some work shoes like to look like a professional adult. These were so cheap at this like discount store, kind of like TJ Maxx, but I feel like even more of a discount. So I just had to go to Nordstrom Rack and get some shoes. How cute are these though for like $40 because I am like walking around all day. I didn't want to spend too much money on them. Um, but I haven't said hi to you guys. I need to give you like an apartment tour and tell you guys all about my life now. 
Um, but let me just say this whole past weekend and up till probably like right now has just been absolutely insane. I live in Chicago now. What? I live in Chicago now and I just found the cutest little area. I keep finding these really cute areas, um, but I got lost. I was like walking around. I'm not a big city girl at all. Um, I got lost, but I found my way back. I found a Chick-fil-A with this crazy drive through just in the city, which is crazy. Because there's like, it was gated off over there. I'm just rambling because I'm so hungry and I miss talking to you guys. But yeah, I was like running around this like huge city block in these boots because I didn't have shoes that were kind to my feet. I'm like running. And then over this side, it got a little sketchy as I was walking. I was like, oh my God, what happened? Um, yeah, so here we are at Chick-fil-A. I'm so excited, I'm getting fries. I didn't really eat that much today because today was crazy. And I've been running on my coffee this morning. Life is good. I haven't gone to the gym in like, I don't even know how many days. So that's gonna be my plan tomorrow. I don't know, I'll fill you guys in. I'm rambling right now. I do have my camera here. So hopefully I'll record something for you guys, like maybe like a day in my life or like what I eat in a day. I don't even know what you guys want to see, so let me know. take my coffee with me it's literally only been two days two days so i don't really have a routine yet but I, this morning i have like some extra time so i kind of figured out the timing a little bit woke up at like 4 30 and i'm gonna make some oats this morning so i was thinking that i could add protein into my oats because I've never done that before. So, if you guys missed my last video, this is my new favorite protein. So, I had a protein shake last night. It was 10 out of 10 amazing. I might make it tonight and show you guys. I'm gonna make it this morning, but I'm trying to think if that will sustain me all morning because I will go from 7.30 until like 12 maybe later so i want to make sure that i stay full and happy so that i can focus so we're gonna try oats this morning um the bagels seem to be doing all right but yeah we're gonna do this in case i don't make it i'll tell you guys the recipe so i i think i might have done it in the last video too but I do two scoops of vanilla, a full banana. You can use fresh or frozen. I use frozen mixed berries and almond milk and water, and it's so good. I also added a clementine yesterday, or you can add like any kind of citrus, lime juice, lemon juice, so good. Also, I wanna get out my lunch to show you guys. I'll probably show you at the office. But, so this red wine quinoa, macaroni gluten-free vegan 
this I got at Costco so long ago, but the ingredients are organic white rice flour, organic white quinoa flour, and organic red quinoa flour. That's it. So I boiled this last night, and then you guys know, if you're new here, this sauce from Aldi has no oil in it. So if it would focus, that would be awesome. So that you guys can see it, take a photo of it, and go grab it. So that's the sauce I'm using. And then I'm thinking that I'm going to take some broccoli with me or like some spinach or something on the side. I like to keep it all in one container. I might cut up this cucumber actually um, as my something green just because that's easier. And my uh, broccoli is still frozen. So I'm going to make my oats. What I like to do is I just boil them. I love that this is gas instead of electric. I was boiling the pasta last night and it took me like two seconds to heat up the stove, which is awesome and like so rare. Cause no, the gas takes forever. I don't know anybody who likes gas. So I had a little bit of salt in my oats. And I also have maple syrup that I got from Aldi as well. I, I almost got, um, almost grabbed the wrong thing and got like actual syrup but this is 100% pure maple syrup so this is what you want and then I'm also gonna add in here when it's done cooking the protein straight in here and then some probably some frozen fruit and whatever I don't eat I will take with me and so I can eat cold oats I just wish it was better there we go i can eat cold oats that doesn't really bother me um so whatever i don't finish here i'll take with and whenever i get a second to hurry up and eat i'll eat something also i've been taking these which i showed you guys last time i believe these oh i took it out of here that go new go bar it's in my last video um they are red i'm gonna go get some more i need to go to target today because my nail polish when you put the cover the color over top of it can you guys see that right here on this nail specifically when you put the clear coat on top of it, it like changes the color of the polish like significantly and it's really ugly so i don't know why it's doing that the only thing i can think of is that it's really old so i need to go get a new top coat so i could do my own nails again <laughs> i know so sad it's okay one day i'll be able to afford <laughs> To get my nails done all the time it's all right um and something else i need to get yeah i'm not used to this cooking this fast let me turn the heat down a little bit um something else i forgot already that's not good i'm gonna add a splash of almond milk in there i also have yogurt in there too what the pasta looks like cooked i know i'm kind of all over the place but i'll hopefully have time to show you guys later but if i don't i just put on here salt pepper and garlic powder so what i'm gonna do is just pour this on top like this and then lunchtime i will just heat that up What's up guys? It's like 6.30 maybe. I just got home like, yeah, 6.30. I just got home probably like 10 minutes ago. Um, I showed you guys what I had for lunch. So we get spoiled at work and have drug reps and they ask the students what we want to eat, which is so nice. This lighting, I cannot. 
Mm. So, I kind of showed you a little bit of that. It was, it even said it on the tray, it was like vegan meatballs with rice and veggies and like a sweet brown sauce, it was so good. So I had that and half of my pasta and a little bit of cucumbers. And then before I left work, so probably like five o'clock-ish, I had a banana and one of those bars. I'm hungry again, but I know what it is. I really need to drink water. Um, but I need to set up my Brita. Mm. So, right now I'm having some raisin bran, which is my fave. <coughs> Excuse me. Raisin bran and almond milk. Sometimes I'll add fruit in there, but it's fine. So I ended up taking my oatmeal to go and I had that after I was finished with rounds this morning and it was so good. You guys, if you haven't already gotten that vanilla protein, get it because you can make anything with it. Now I'm thinking I can make like protein muffins, like take my whole food plant-based muffin recipe and add protein powder to it. It's just one of those proteins that tastes really good. You get your protein in, but it doesn't taste like protein. There's no texture, there's no nasty flavor, it just tastes like vanilla, it's really, really good. So I've had that in my smoothie and in my oats today and it's been phenomenal. So I will leave my discount code below. Um, I believe it's 27%, I'll put it on the screen also. Um, I think it's like 27 Sarah C, I wanna say. Um, you guys know I love Earth Chimp, but like, I really didn't think I would love the vanilla because I've never had a vanilla protein that I liked. This one is amazing. So yeah, if you guys haven't got your hands on that, make sure you do that. I'm gonna enjoy, enjoy my second bowl of cereal and probably take a nap, I'm so tired. But I only have like um, rounds tomorrow, so I'm gonna go home and see my man. I'm so excited, so yeah. I'll show you guys what I have for dinner and we'll round out the video. Hopefully it's a nice, short, simple one, easy for me to edit and easy for you guys to watch really quickly and don't, you know, cause I'm jabbering on a lot. I also took a little bit of footage last week. When I tell you my stress level was like at an all time high last week, it was at an all time high last week. It was not good. So this week has been stressful, but in a different way, stressful like I'm getting thrown to, into all these new things that I'm not used to, but I'm okay with that because this is what I've been working towards and it's been so fun and I pray that it continues to be this fun and yeah, I'm like feeling really good about it other than like being far from my family and like everything I'm used to. I'm like not a city girl and like I have to talk to you guys about that too because like going out and like even shopping, like grocery shopping, something I love, or like going to Target or whatever, I had to do the meter and like, was like, oh God, how much time do I have left? And it was like stressful. Um, and then I found like a really great Target that like had no meter and like, you just have to like find places to go. And then in the city by myself, it's different from being in the suburbs. <sighs> but yeah, so I'm adjusting and hopefully taking you guys along for the ride. So I'm gonna enjoy my cereal and like just relax for a bit. And I need to do my nails tonight, write my notes out, and take a nap hopefully. But I'll show you guys what I have for dinner. Bye.